So we're staying at the Sea Witch, along with a few feathered friends. Apparently we're not the only ones that's gonna be enjoying this pool. So I'm over here at Carolina Beach. <coughs> Near Wilmington, and here's the boardwalk. It's pretty cool. Little boardwalk area they got right here. We're flying through. It's pretty hip in the evenings. You got a lot of people hanging out and all these little pubs and stuff. And, and it's surprising because it might not look like there's a lot of people. And then all of a sudden, you walk in a place and it's slam packed. I mean, wall to wall. We did find plenty of vegan options. You know, the weather is not perfect for the beach, but it's definitely a nice getaway from where we're normally at and pretty inexpensive. Like I said, we're staying at the Sea Witch and it was only like 330 bucks for two nights. And it's a pretty nice room. Here's where we stayed the last two days. It's a little messy because, well, we've been staying here the last two days. It's really nice. It's, you know, on the beach and got all this wood and sort of kitchen area with the refrigerator. This TV and this noisy fan. I don't know why. I mean, I can turn it off, of course. But, and then here's the bathroom. And I like that it doesn't have any carpet. You don't have to worry about all those nasty bugs or whatever from hotels. Overall, it was clean, nice little recliner. The only qualms was that fan. And at night, these windows, man, they had, they had a light. They had a light. I'll show you this light right here. Shine, there's, there's, there's at least one of them and they shine right in these windows and they make it impossible to sleep. We had to hang like a towel up right up in here. Now, this is not a vegan place, but the lady that was running it, her daughter was vegan or is vegan. And she, she was kind enough to help us out by contacting her daughter and seeing if she had any suggestions for places. And she mentioned Hell's Kitchen and that was another place or two, but they're not vegan places either. So nothing really was vegan around here. So we couldn't make this really about vegan link. And I decided then I might as well just do something with vegan walk. And so I did a video about being in Wilmington and being vegan with your family here in uh, Carolina Beach and Wilmington area. We packed, you know, plenty of things, and, you know, in case we needed something like uh, raisins and nuts and oatmeal and seeds and different fruit like bananas and apples, of course. And my wife always packs some sort of kind of, you know, vegan bars. And then, of course, we can always go to like the Mexican place and the Thai place and, and anything else out there that is remotely potentially vegan friendly, like the Eatery 17. That actually ended up being the best place that we've been to so far. We may hit a couple places in Wilmington next, 